Hi everyone, Maria here from Social Insider. We're kicking off 2021 with a new report unveiling the social media industry benchmarks to have a clear idea about where your brand is positioned against industry standards. We looked into over 22 million posts on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter from 35 industries. We created a correlation between the social media performance of 2019 and 2020, which can help you shape on your strategy this year, optimize your social media content and learn which social media channel holds the audience that you're looking for. We wanted to figure out the social media engagement rate for each industry, understand their posting frequency and find out what mix of photos and videos they use across Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. Continue watching this video to find out what we discovered. Here are the 35 industries we analyzed. I was telling you in the beginning that we analyzed 35 industries. Well, all industries choose images as the primary social media content. 84% photos on Instagram, 75% photos on Facebook and almost 53% images on Twitter. The trending platform of the moment, Instagram, seems to be where brands are increasingly turning. Overall, the average engagement rate for brands increased in 2020 with 6.39%. When it comes to social media performance for Twitter, the engagement has dropped from 0.07% in 2019 to 0.06% in 2020 across all industries. Across all industries, brands choose to post 36% more content on Twitter compared with Instagram and Facebook in 2020. On Instagram feed, the posting frequency declined by about 6.22% in 2020 and these brands focus their content efforts on Instagram stories too. The politics, education and airline brands are the most successful profiles on Instagram with the highest average engagement rates out of all industries. On Twitter, the politics industry generates more conversations with an average engagement rate of 0.45% followed by the conglomerate, restaurant, cafe and sports media industries. But given the fact that this has been an election year, it's not a surprisingly result. Within this report, we provide a representative sample of US and international brands that had an active presence on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter between January 2019 and the end of October 2020, categorizing them into industries based on their activity and page category settings. If you want to discover more, please continue reading our study, you will find the link in the description.